Hello guys, this is Eric Tutorials, and in today's tutorial, I'll be showing you how to create a glossy text in Adobe Photoshop. And as you can see here, uh, this is what we're going to be creating today. So I think it looks really nice. Um, I really like the the line that runs through the middle. So this is what we're going to be creating today. So go to File New. The dimensions I like to use is 12, 19, 20, and 1080 pixels. Uh, background transparent and OK. So, first of all, let's create our text. So, go to the text tool, uh, put the, you know, the size uh, to 200. So, yeah, let's type in our tutorials. And the font I like to use is slant. Okay, let's reduce the size. Hold shift and make this text smaller. A little bit bigger. And hit enter. Okay, uh, now double click on the text and select drop shadow. Uh, on drop shadow, uh, the settings we're going to use a spread uh, 26%, size 9 pixels, and color black, opacity 100, blend mode, multiply, distance 0, and then inner shadow, and um, here, same thing, blend mode, multiply, black color. Uh, opacity 100, distance 0, choke 0, size 16 pixels. And um, outer glow here we're going to use uh, blend mode normal, opacity 75%, noise 0, uh, color black, uh, spread 0, size 5, and range 50%. And then um, we're going to use stroke, so select stroke. And here, uh, we'll get to this later. We'll just, just select stroke for now. And uh, now select gradient overlay. And here's the important part. Uh, just select the default uh, black to white. And drag black in the middle. And then change the color to light gray and then drag <coughs> white in the middle and then uh, just put them together put white on top of the black so you have white on top and black at the bottom and just put it right on black so that you have a crisp line going across and then on one edge double click or maybe one click I don't know and uh, select the color either white or black it's up to you I like to use black and yeah click OK and then click here and double click to change the color and this might be like uh, dark gray and then hit OK and then uh, again hit OK and then select the color color overlay uh, and put the opacity to 47 percent blend mode normal and change the color to whatever you want you can change it to white you can change it to black you can just change it to any color um, I actually prefer this color I think it looks really nice so yeah we got our color and then um, hit OK and now let's go to the stroke part and uh, here select the size to uh, 2 pixels 2 pixels I think looks good and then uh, fill type 
change this to gradient and change the gradient uh, just select the default and then here drag this in the middle the black and change this to light gray and then the white drag this in the middle too and again put them both on top of each other okay and then on one edge uh, put um, kind of light grayish on the other edge but more uh, even lighter than this gray so really light gray and then uh, hit OK and change the style to linear uh, angle 0 scale 100 percent and and then go to Bravel or Bevel and Emboss select that and uh, the depth change this change the depth to one uh, one percent size zero soft and zero uh, technique smooth and style uh, stroke and emboss I mean stroke emboss okay and put the angle somewhere uh, to 90 and 58 okay or and now now change the depth to I think 1000 percent uh, yeah I think it looks good uh, I think this will be pretty much it for the tutorial um, thank you for watching guys I hope you like it if you do please subscribe and favorite and uh, thumbs up the video if you don't please don't hate it and uh, see you next time